Okay, and then how I can inspect this my engine's pistons. And first we inspect these uh, piston rings. And here we have this my piston num number four. And first the step is to check that how this my piston rings moves because it is really really important that all of these piston rings smoothly when I rotate this by my hand is smoothly and the first one moves second and then even this oil ring moves quite quite nicely and it is e interesting and that means that now this this pistons all of these piston rings they are qu quite good shape that only in only in here is of course little bit corrosion but these piston rings they are not stuck and that means that now piston number four these pistons are okay and then I take next piston now we have this piston number one and here we can see that there is now a lot of this there is a lot of corrosion in that up area but let's check pistons first piston ring moves smoothly and then second and also this oil ring look it looks well that no any stuck in here and we can see that that this this piston is also also fine okay and then we look next piston what is piston number two and also this piston rings move smoothly there is only corrosion in this up area but it is not so bad because piston rings they are movable and also oil ring is fine okay and that means now that that I have three pistons what are okay and one of these my pistons what was this piston number three there was situation that this oil ring it was stuck and it, it means that it don't move like these another ones and now I have also take out these all piston rings in that area and that means that this piston is ready for new piston rings installation okay but this was this idea that how to check that are these my cars piston rings okay or bad and this my case I had situation that three pistons piston rings are fine and only one was situation that this third oil ring it don't move it, it was like that but no any movement okay good okay and then how to inspect this piston status and here I have one good example of pistons and this piston belongs to this Toyota dual VVTi engine and how I can inspect that first step is that I need clean cotton cloth and I start this my inspection so that I check first this upper area and I clean all of this corrosion away and this is actually very clean piston head and there is like 200,000 miles and then I check that another area and for that inspection now I have to take these piston rings away and it happens so that I little bit bend that first piston ring in that position 
and I keep one hand in here and carefully now they are like in starting position and then I move that carefully and now this piston ring one opens and then the second piston ring in here I rotate this in that way and then I take the second this is like second piston ring and I move that in here and then I take the other part and now this second piston ring opens also and then I have this final part is to take this oil ring away and this is a little bit difficult because there is two parts in there and first I have to little bit move that outer part and then this another and I have to move those away and this rotation is key and now outer part is free and then this inner part this this opens so that I insert my finger in that way and then I move that and then if we have some sorry small nail and screw like that this is really useful because now I can insert that in this way and then I can move this oil ring away in that way carefully okay now now oil oil ring is free this is oil ring and then then I can continue this is my inspection using this clean cotton cloth and now I have to clean all of these areas in here in that way and now I am trying to find any burn out signs in here and burn out is that there is different color in here this black one is normal because it is like oil now I check and then I also I am looking for any crack or dents in here because they are bad now and then in here I check that these holes are free that I can see through of those they are oil holes oil hole holes and now when I there is some small scratch in here in this area very small but not not too bad and now when I have made this inspection I look also their inner and then I check this connection rod that there is no any any burn out and everything looks Okay, I can say that this piston is ready and it is good quality piston. This is good quality piston and we can continue to use that piston and I need to only replace this, this uh, piston rings and then this is ready for use. Okay. And then, then we look next piston, what is in here, and let's look at what is this status, and same idea, I first rotate a little bit this, my piston rings that I can take this away, and now I take this first compression ring and there is a little bit dirty and then second compression rate that way Okay, and second compression ring is free, and then I take this and 
to understand this oil ring and then I take this oil ring using this my screw away and this seems to be a little bit difficult difficult to open okay now, now I managed to take it, good, and then, then I, then I move this oil ring away, and then I clean this piston, and I am now looking at this, is there any scratch? or something else and and this this looks also quite okay and this is this idea how to inspect pistons and piston rings